hear it. Or let you know it. So I'm going to show you something I found out about an update on eBay's envelope. So what is eBay's envelope? Well, eBay's envelope is for training cards. Any training card that's under $20 or under, you can ship one ounce for 51 cents. That was what that was with the, the weight of the card and the weight of the envelope. Two ounces, seven ounces, three ounces, 91 cents. And which is pretty good deal. Um, and then you could, and then had, and then you could combine ores, train card ores. But if the train, if they ship, if they ship train cards over $50. It does not cost for EBC and Mope. If you if they combine sh- orders, combine shipping, $50 is the most you can ship in EBC and Mope. With trinkets. And then, because before people were going to order, they were shipping with a stamp. And shipping with a stamp, no, bro. I mean, you can ship. I mean, you're kind of risking it because if the buyer claims, some buyers will be honest and they will claim. Some buyers will be honest and will claim item not received when they actually have not received the item in like two, three weeks. Say, in a while. <coughs> Let's say then, like two, three weeks after they ordered, they actually haven't got it yet. They'll uh, claim I've never seen it. I'll be honest about it. And then you'll get the buyers that won't leave feedback in, or they won't leave feedback on it. But they got it and they didn't, and they didn't open it. I'm not received because they got it. I mean, you, I mean, the buyers that don't um, leave feedback don't know if they got it or not, um, or they never um, opened a cake. Like a, I'm not received the case. You didn't leave feedback, but um, but with this though, um, uh, it protects you against it because you can't, and then you can't have buyers like open false. I'm not received claim saying like a card, say a card you ship. Let's say five dollars free ship with a stamp. Guess what? They say I'm not received. And they actually received it. There's no way to prove it. So you have to refund them. You have to refund them. It's best eBay's deep. You have to give away. You have no choice. So. So I'm going to. So this way. You don't have to give a leave. So you can prove it's a little. I mean it's still a little sketchy. Maybe not the greatest tracking thing, but it's cheap, and especially if you're shipping cheap cards with free ship or charge and ship. This way, you don't have to like charge like three dollars shipping or tracking. You don't have you don't have to say hey, we have no phones. You have to charge like a flat three dollars, say three dollars shipping charge. You don't have to do that now. You do the eBay ammo. <laughs> you know. You basically envelope is coming out for coins. You can ship coins, stamps, and postcards. That's right. But with the EBSD envelope in the past, you can only ship so many cards that were not in top loaders and sleeves. Then you can only ship up to so many cards in top loaders. Because of the weight or whatever. Um, then you can ship graded cards in the past. Graded cards with eBay Studio. Which I understand. Because some of those great cards are pretty expensive. And then. Another one is. Um, 
That's basically what I like eBay's envelope. I mean, eBay's envelope is a pretty good way to do stuff. You can do like no way coins, you know, like slabbed coins. Basically, like slabbed coins, like that, like graded, graded coins, like great slabbed coins. You can't do none of them. Which I understand because I'm probably way more than three ounces. I can slab it a lot. And you can do so many raw coins. You can do like so many raw coins. Or like coin, like raw coins, like wrap it up in bubble wrap, this and that. Or coins and flips. So, I think I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try the um, eBay student. And um, if I get like sports, I haven't tried out eBay student envelope yet. <laughs> um, with sports screens, I might, um, they do have a few envelopes. Oh. Okay. Yeah, you have like 57 envelopes. That's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> I'm going to um, do that with um, the yeah, Mr. Envelope. So I can do like, like cheap train cards. That's what I'm gonna do. Like, cause it says, so basically anything I can print it, print it on there. I'm gonna ship with you, and I don't mind. Cause it's guaranteed way that, um, you can get like say offer cheaper shipping, like say offer like three dollar, have to charge three dollar shipping on something. You can charge say like. 91 cent ship on three on ship and you can basically offer cheaper shipping for the buyers and you save them and you get you get um you make more you make more train cards out of like lower train cards if you're charging shipping if you're charging three dollars shipping you're charging 91 cent and you're also getting a flat ship you're also um, on the lower end cards and you're going to tip yourself at the same time. So, what are you doing?